This is KL Imports. Today um, we're working on the CRX, checking the check engine light. What I have here is um, we're running an OBD0 to an OBD1, and in order to check the check engine light, there's a connector down here. All you have to do is jump it from one end to the other, and um, I'm going to show you. Once you got this jump, go here to the car. All you have to do is turn the ignition on to two clicks. Notice uh, the check engine light is not working. So uh, in order to solve that problem, there must be a problem with the ground to uh, for the service. So um, what I'm gonna do here is um, I'm gonna go down here to this ECU let's pull this one out right here what I'm going to do is I'm going to go here to the ECU and um, I'm going to tap into the wire um, D4 okay since we couldn't get a um, check engine light to come on through that connector so therefore we're going to go to uh, D4 on this uh, ECU and we're going to tap into D4 which is um, service ground check engine light and um, we're going to take that and we're going to go to the ground. Notice um, I ran the wrong wire. So you see here, here's a good ground for me. I'm going to put my hand in here and ground this. And once I ground this, the checking engine light should start blinking. And there you go. And notice you see how it blinked real fast? Every time it blinked fast like that, it counts as one. So my check engine light code is throwing one two three four five six so that's the code six if it's a longer blink that means it's count as ten so that's that's how you're gonna find out what your check engine light is if you can get the other way to work okay now that I already fixed everything I put everything back um, we can go ahead and start the car I changed out the temperature sensor that's what it was that was flashing and uh, let's see if the check engine might go away yep so far so good